back another video about tomorrow and today I'm going to show you how to set up a website and set up a website on your VPS server so the first thing we want to do is we want to go to Google so let's do this and what you need is a website template I like bootstrap so let's go to bootstrap website template okay um, that's fine but that's grayscale is a good one any of these you can use let me see if I can find one that I use. So you can use it too. Uh, bootstrap. It was called Grayscale. Once you have this folder, where is it? Here it is. Preview and download. Download. Okay, go to your downloads and get that folder. And it's there. Copy that. Create a new folder. And pop it in there paste extract here okay this is the the contents that we add to a folder I'm going to show you in a sec but for now right click and edit and this is what you would edit um, if you wanted to look at it just double click it this is what it looks like in a minute uh, so if we wanted to change the pictures etc just drop a different image in here um, obviously edit anything you want to edit um, if we go to where's the main big I haze save that as you can see it's now changed so change pictures change your information get it how you want it and then for instance if you look at I haze's website nice and simple exactly the same I just changed the images a bit of information happy days but now to get this on the server once you're done you need a domain name obviously. We'll just zip this back up. Let's go across to our VPS server. Let me just whack it in here for transferring. Upload desktop. New folder three. That one there, lovely jubbly. Is the server restarted? I just restarted it. Jeez. business. So if you're familiar with VPS servers and you've been setting up Armour 3 servers, and more than likely you have if you're on my channel, uh, yeah, you should have this program that's called Xamp. Xamp. If you haven't, go and download it. Uh, so yeah, the server's just starting back up. It was playing up. Come on. So then you go to your domain registrar, mine being 123 reg. And for testing purposes, this is the domain we're going to use, Python security. So we want to go to manage DNS, advanced DNS, and you need a DNS entry at and a DNS entry www. Okay, type AA and change this destination IP to that server IP, which is 7491.112.7491. Seventy-four, ninety-one, one twelve, one three, one. Same again on the one below. So this is pointing that domain name to our server. Okay. Uh, let's go back to. leave it as your default name servers is my server restarted let's just join it again Roger Rabbit still restarting I'll show you on the different server but when you come back to if you want to go to Python security code.uk to show, show you what I mean that this works and then go for it because it will be restarted by then so we just come off this let's go to a different server so you've got we've got our website template which is here 
So we're going to download that onto the server. This one's OK. And then you go to wherever XAMPP is installed. Obviously you need XAMPP. Oh, that's bloody flash from Java. Our XAMPP is installed in the C drive and it's there, XAMPP. OK. Let me just show you something. If you've got XAMPP, the Apache has to be installed within it. And when it pops up, I'll show you what I mean. Here we are. So the Apache there, install that service. I install M3 services. That's obviously for my database for my Armor 3 servers. Install Apache, and then when you go into your C drive or wherever you installed XAMPP, you have HTTP docs. So that folder of the website template put all its contents in here. So there would have been that index that we edited. That's my index that the website has showed you, for instance. Come on. Jesus went slow, this needs a restart and all. I haze. Anything I change in here or any pictures will immediately change on the, the internet. So that's it. As long as your domain name is pointing to your server, which it is, it's just a different server for testing. Let me see if the other main server is back up so we can get, get it live. It's still stuck restarting. Oh, that's bloody. That's got the main control panel. Let me restart it. But that's how you do it, guys. First of all, your your domain name. You point to your server with the at and www records records to your IP. Download your website template. Edit your template. Upload your template to the server. Install XAMPP. Install the Apache. Uh, and yeah, in the HTTP docs within the XAMPP folder, add the website template. And happy days. Hope it helps. See you again. Remember to like and subscribe. Adios.